The federal government has given official notice that it's prepared to legislate an end to the rotating postal strikes. The Canada Post walkouts are in their fifth week amid a massive backlog of undelivered packages across the country. With some of the biggest online shopping events starting in mere hours, retailers and consumers are concerned holiday shipments won't make it to the doorsteps in time. The Labour Minister says she doesn't want to use back-to-work legislation, but the clock is ticking. Listen, I have to do what's right for the country, and I have to do what's right for um, workers of this country as well. And so, you know, as a Minister of Labour, my decision is that uh, these two parties have had a very long time to work out a deal, um, and we will take action if they cannot get a deal. Having said that, I expect them to work uh, extremely hard over the next uh, couple days to, to reach that conclusion. Unionized employees on the front line say they want a deal that's negotiated, not legislated. We believe in, in, in collective bargaining, uh, both sides coming together and dealing with their issues, whether it's rotating strikes or whatnot. We feel the best settlement for both is at the negotiating table and not interference from the federal government on back-to-work legislation. The federal Liberals say just because they've given the required 48 hours notice before possibly introducing back-to-work legislation, it doesn't mean they will make that move. The government has also reappointed Morton Michnik as a special mediator and signaled he will get the time that he needs.